Hello everybody, we're to the episode of Seven Days to Die where the morning is upon us. The sun, it is set, uh, rise, the sun it is rising. And today, it, it appears, I ask you guys some questions and you guys seem to agree with me on the questions. You guys, I was like, Star. Well, no, I was not like Star because I'm Star. And I was like, yo guys, I got a question for you. And you're like, all right, Star, shoot with the question. And I'm like, all right, I'm gonna shoot. And you know what I shot with? I shot. With this question asking, what do we do? It's morning. We could be going out. We could be going to an outpost, which I'm kind of craving to do. But then we're going to miss out on this great opportunity up here where we get to listen to zombies blow themselves up down there. Instead of us being blown up. All right, I'm, I'm so used to getting blown up. It's just, it's just nice to see someone else get blown up for a change. Uh, but this gives us the great opportunity to continue looting through the bookstore because there are a couple of key recipes like the toilet and the poo. The poo with the most key of recipes out there, but there are a couple of key recipes that we are still missing in our backlog of knowledge known as the brain. Oh my god, we just moved from toilet to fancy toilet. That is an upgrade. Must feel awful to be that toilet sitting right next to your fancy brother. <laughs> but yeah, I don't- you guys seem to agree with me that I don't want to go miss out on some of these recipes because we do really require some recipes like chainsaws, augers. I think we're missing a couple of gun recipes too. But these are all recipes that are going to be super important moving forward. So it's probably not a good idea to just try and ditch them. So the game plan is I want to finish looting this place. I'm going to go through. I'm not even going to bother looting these things unless it's worth looting. So if it's like an oven, whatever. I'm going to try to break through a good amount of these. I don't want to break through too much, but I'll break through a good amount. Uh, and then if we still got time, we will make our way home. And today's day 13. So that means we're one day away from day 14. Might be a good time to start doing some of that resource collection. But... Before we begin the resource collection, what I want to do is I want to go meander on through. Why is there plastic in a bookstore box? I want to meander on through a couple of the traders because today is restock day. And hello, look at that thing. If only I could pick it up. But no, apparently it's too difficult. Someone else put it down. So obviously I can never hold it. Other, that's, that's illegal. That's illegal. You can't do that. It's stealing. Can't steal dead dude stuff. That's extra stealing. That's grave robbing. That's 20 years to death. In Startopia, I don't know. Maybe one day when I buy a private island, you know, it, I mean, let's be honest, a private island would probably be like a speck of sand in the middle of the sea, but still, I mean, so what what makes an island an island? I don't know. And I don't gotta know. I just got, you know, I'm living on an island right now. An island of solitude and homework. It's not the best island in the world, I'll say that. Uh, but okay, there's not gonna be much there. We'll keep on going. I do wanna get through the main area, and I have no clue how to get to the main. Then I make a. I know we can get through there. Oh, I know. We just got to do a small, a wee little bit of parkour there, laddie. That's all that we got to do. There we go. And just uh, hop on up through there. So everything there is good. We'll try and get a couple of these things as well. Because I saw some pretty good logic in the comments. Like, like Star, you need knowledge. And I'm like, I know I need knowledge. So you don't want to miss it. So let's make sure. Hey, a quest. Or I can buy a farm. Yo, I want to buy a farm. I want to own a firm. Let's own a firm. Hell, Survivor, I guess you found the note we left in. Now that the cat's been out the bag, let's get down to business. We've been watching you and think you might make a good recruit, but before we open our doors to a stranger, let's see if you can do this simple task. Um, slicker than cat doo-doo on linoleum, Willy. Challenge, kill some animals. Well, Willy, I assume that you may have had a problem with, uh, uh, FIFA. Not FIFA, why did I say FIFA? With PETA. In the past, in which case I apologize that PETA apparently sued this man in a prior life, but uh, in seven days to that, I'm guessing PETA didn't survive because it tried to, like, you know, keep all the zombie animals alive, and then the zombie animals just kind of ate all the PETA people, so that's unfortunate, but what can you do, you know, when you're zombifying animal? Alright, I'm just, I'm just saying. Zombified animals are probably not the most friendly. Like, if you got an aggressive animal, you know, someone like a bear, listen, a bear, someone's gonna be like, Star, bears aren't aggressive. Okay, anything that can rip off my face if I piss it off is not, not, I, I don't know. They're scary. Let's put it at that. You ever try pissing off a bear? Yeah, that's right. Because the people that did are probably not here because I, I don't know. They're probably out in the wilderness still fighting in like some mortal, you know, combat to the death with that bear. That's a sofa. Oh my good. Oh my good. Oh my good, it's not good, man. Oh, destroyed bank, full of nothing. What a poopy bank, man. Mm -mm, I ain't taking nothing of that bank, that's for sure. Okay. Uh, nothing but disappointment in these boxes, as per usual. What else could we have expected? But I'm really hopeful that we can get through some of the, uh, I think we still got like a couple of rooms to check out here, which I might do. Because there's some sort of... <laughs> yeah, I... I see this refrigerator. Sorry, fridge. Not even my love for food can keep this secret safe. 
There better be something good here, okay? If there's not something good in this doorway, we may have issues. But I'm excited to hopefully get to those traders, and hopefully they really got some good stuff going on. Like, let's say for... Don't even tell me! Who would barricade off a bathroom? Why would you barricade a bathroom? What's the point of this? Is it because someone's gonna, like, fall down through that roof there, probably? Yeah, I'm just gonna break it now, just for kind of future reference. I should use wood. What a poopy, poopy floor. Yeah, yeah, it is. Oh my good. Are you serious? Ah, <sighs> it's- it, it, I seriously, I don't get a face- it, it, I, I've said this all the time. I don't get a Facebook notification for years! Years! You know what happens as soon as I hit that record button, all of a sudden you know that that- the barrage is about to begin. The only barrage I care about is a barrage of food in my mouth. Specifically, donuts. I'm currently craving donuts. If any of you guys, you know, I got the hookup. If any of you guys are like CEO at Dunkin' Donuts, I'm just saying, put in a good word and tell Dunkin' Donuts to hook me up with the donut sponsorship, all right? Because I'm already going to Dunkin' Donuts getting my dollar iced coffee every day because my Dunkin' Donuts near me, you know. Not to be confused, I'm, I'm serious. Dunkin' Donuts does not sponsor me, but the fact that they hook it up with me on the day-to-day -day with the dollar dollar iced coffee is pretty good already, so I, I gotta give them props to that. But I think that's just a local thing. I think that's like only in my store, because every time I go back home from college, it's like, yeah, it's gonna be $3 for that. I'm like, well then, I will no longer be buying your product, good sir. That is a good book that we have just learned. We did not know how to make a lot rocket launcher all this time, but that's good. Now we can actually start piecing together, hopefully a very powerful one. What the hell, dude? That's like three bookstore boxes. In a row, and just because I said that we're gonna get a toilet. No, what is this? Is this room purely bookstore? I don't want to jinx it. I don't want to jinx it. I don't want to. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. If we're gonna learn some knowledge, this is the room to do it. But as soon as we do get out of here, ah, yes, of course it's a fridge. As soon as we do get out of here, that is the game plan. Head on over to one of the. Hello. I may make some sacrifices for this. I will put away the chairs. Hello, repair kits. I'd like to use you specifically not to repair that. I thought there was something that I could repair. I guess not. Oh, is that? Yeah, there we go. We could use some of the repair kits on that mini bike. Is that all that are repaired? Are you serious? The hell? Am I, cra am I, am I crazy? Are those two different? Oh, those, those are two different things. God dang it. <laughs> I thought, for some reason, I thought I, like, teleported there, and I'm like, oh, it did repair, obviously. No, it did repair. I just happened to be a dingus. It's a blessing. I'm, I don't know. It's not really a blessing unless it makes me, like, adorably stupid at times. But, hey, if I can be adorably stupid and bring a smile to your face, so be it. I will be the most adorable stupid in the world. Okay. I, I, I want to get back there. I don't... Th you know what? Yeah, I'm just going to break the fridge. And I'll... You know what I think we'll do? We'll finish up this room, because this room does seem pretty promising so far. And then we'll head on up, because that other room did not seem promising. But this room, listen, minimal toilets and a fridge. Okay, and an air conditioner, I guess. Maybe our luck is about to turn around in a bad way. Yeah, yeah, here, here's all the appliance. No clue why a freaking, like, bookstore CEO tower out here is trying to ship, like, toilets and stuff worldwide. Last I checked, all right, my dad's a plumber. Let me just say, I don't think that he's currently employed by a, a bookstore, okay? Because I don't like my dad. Listen, I don't know. I, I, I was going to go somewhere with that, but I, I was thinking my dad is too epic. I, I can't say nothing bad about my pops. My pops, he, he's, he's a legend. Why? I don't know. Just one time, he, we, me and my friends were hanging out in the garage. He walks in and unearths from, from a single a, a styrofoam box, kind of like a cooler. It's shaped like a cooler, but it was pure styrofoam, and he unearths a potato. And then he turns to us, and in his thick Polish accent, he says, Potato. And then he walks out. And this is why I just have undying love for my dad. He is... I wish I could document every moment that Papa Papa Star... That Papa Star has experienced with Papa Papa Star, because Papa Papa Star is a freaking Papa if I've ever seen one. Uh, we might give up on these early. This is... Okay, never mind. Uh... Oh yeah, we're, we'll finish these two lower shelves and then we'll head on to the next floor because we're eh, eh, mm, That's not too good. Ah, uh, do we got anything to drink? I sure as hell hope that we do. Ooh, yeah, we got some bottled water down there. Oh, very nice, very nice. We're gonna be needing that because the thirst is coming through. Hey, a commercial toilet. I feel like my dad would love this game. He could like, he could turn all, he could turn every type of toilet into a fancy toilet. I will say that right now. 
All right, even though plumbers work with way more than toilets, I think we all know that toilets are truly what spins the world around. Toilets are what make the world's economy for without the ability to defecate. What are we really but humble creatures and that, that can't poop? Poop's pretty important. Think about it. If you couldn't poop, where would the poop go? Hmm? Yeah. Yeah, that's right. That's right. It's, it's like a classic puzzle. Like if a tree falls in the woods and no one hears it. I know I could take that. I... Eh. Eh. I, I got other things I'd rather hold on to. Like that one repair kit. It's one repair kit, but that's still a repair kit. Uh, but like the classic riddle. If a tree falls in the forest, but no one hears it. Did it really make a sound? Just like... If the toilet does not exist, does the world economy really go around? And the answer... I think goes without saying. But okay, let's head on to this top floor. Toilet philosophy aside. Let's make our way over to where the way need to be headed. And oh, look at that. Just giant. Yeah, okay. I think we have... We might be able to take that as a shortcut. Sure, we might lose a foot or two, but eh. Those are replaceable. Just tape that thing right back up and you should be good to go. Uh, that should take us to the top floor if we wanted to go. This is just another level, I think. This is the printing level. A little bit poopier. Oh, he's dead. Gorgeous. Boop. Oh, come on, man. You gotta die. Oh, yeah, if you're the man right there, they will die. How ah, where did the tarnation did you come from? Eat sledge. Oh, my mama. Oh, my mama. How are you? Oh, it's because I have no stamina. That would explain things. All right. Eat arrow. Okay. Never mind. Just gotta eat arrow. Boy. There you go. All right. You, you want to eat another one? Yeah, I know. It takes some vitamin arrow. Oh, how's the vitamin taste? You're lucky this isn't last day on Earth, otherwise you might be eating some vitamin P right now. Like your floater bloater brethren. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna bust- I'll bust through a couple here for good luck. Depends on what this is. It's a cabinet, okay. That's bad luck, bad sign. Let's keep moving forward. Uh, so I don't think the printing floor has too much amazing stuff going on. Except the crawler, who's a debtor. He's now crawling to his death. Uh, but I think this should be... A couple of things. Yeah, there we got where the floor would have went out on us. Got a couple of backpacks here with like, okay things. Could be worse, could be better. I thought I just scrapped the bear. What? What? Did I not just scrap? Did I just hit repair on that on accident? Bruh. I think I did just hit repair on that. Well then, I think our stupidity has peaked for today. Hopefully it doesn't go much higher than that. <laughs> Nothing like using a repair kit on something you're about to scrap. Oh man, if our stupidity reaches higher levels today, we are, uh, we're in for a treat. Maybe you guys are in for a treat, but me, I'm in for some pain and suffering. <laughs> All right. Okay, never mind. I thought I could open those doors in epic fashion. All right. Here's Johnny. In, in, in a second. Just, just give me, here's Johnny. Where you guys at? Huh? So we got that doorway there. We got this doorway here. We got a, oh, okay. I'll take these. Hey, listen, if there's boxes that I don't have to break. That's a different story. I will read those things to the bank. I will literally bring these, go to the bank, sit down on a sofa, and just start reading. And then a bank account manager will approach me, and I'll be like, chill. I'm reading. All right? This very nice stripper sold me some amazing books up at the top floor of the CEO. Uh, at the top floor of a uh, thing. You know? Uh, the thing. I, I forget the name. A giant bookstore uh, tower. I, I feel like there's a... I, I'm trying to come up with like an official name of saying this. I am struggling to do anything official. All right. How have you survived? Okay, yeah, she has not survived. I, whoo! Hey, thank you. I'll take that. Oh, look at that tattoo. Nice little tattoo there. GG on the tattoo. Okay. I think that leaves us a couple of boxes we could open up. Oh! We got a biker. We got a big old tough biker. And I got a big old tough cement on a stick. Yeah, and it's like cement on a stick. No one ever expects a cement on a stick. Oh, no. I was, as I was saying, no one ever expects cement on a stick. Okay, he's- he's expecting- Okay, no. He doesn't expect- Okay, he doesn't expect- Okay. They're expecting it! They're not dying! I was about to say, that's the head explosions I want. Also, why does that man have a beard after I blew up his head? Do you- Oh my god. That's next level facial hair. When it grows out of... Your spine. <laughs> it doesn't grow out of his face or his follicles. That thing's growing straight out of his spine. Oh my goodness. Uh, okay, I'm gonna take these first aid kits. Honestly, I'll take them over the band-aids. Band-aids are... Yeah, meh. Could be better. Uh, talk, I did not know the zombie bikers can actually have good loot, though. Lockers... Not too awful. I'm just so anxious, dude. I wanna, I wanna finish looting this place up so we can go out and get... You know what we wanna get? Oh, you know what we wanna get. You know what I wanna get. I wanna get... Why is there just random scrap there? 
I want to go to a trader. Wherever he may be. I don't know which direction. I think I think he's actually out east. But still, that will be good. And good is very good. Okay, these torches, I feel like, usually are a sign. Like, I feel like every... Yeah. Yeah. Look at that, dude. Ow. I could end it poorly. Torches. I feel like every time I see a torch, it's trying to tell you, Hey! Over here! Uh, for some reason, the person who designed and architecturally structured this building put a torch here. Obviously not for some sort of secret path. No, we don't we don't know what secrets are over here at the fun pimps at the, the developers of the game who also may be okay. Ninja! Uh would have been better if his head blew up. Oh! I'll take that. Good constellation prize. Still not as cool as blowing up right away, but better than nothing. Uh but I don't think we can go any further until I think this is the roof and this will top it off. Yeah. Set it there, top it off, because it's a roof. Ah! God, I'm so funny. Laugh at me. Laugh at me or I will blow up your head with a sledgehammer. Uh, you, you've seen me do it before. I will do it again. I know there's, I want to say there's a couple of gun safes around here. Problem is gun safes just take so, 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 so long to break into. And I don't like taking long periods of time to break into things. Because they're annoying. <gasps> oh, wait, we already knew that. Damn, man, they got some quality reading here, but not the quality reading that I'm after. I do like the quality legs explosions over there. Oh, these guys might have some money, 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 money. You got money for me. I'm just collecting the debts. And sorry, man, I'm, I'm secretly part of the, the zombie mafia. And you guys did not pay your zombie debts, so I'm coming for that sweet old zombie money, money, money. That we're gonna sell and make some more money. Uh, we might be able to get into there. I don't know if this even has anything good here. Or if this is just, like, the stairway down. Uh, I'm pretty sure it might be. Okay, there you go. I'm gonna let, I'm gonna let him do the rest of the heavy lifting there. I wonder. Uh, <laughs> okay, this might go poorly or it might go very well. Uh, this is where the parkour comes in handy. I wonder, is there absolutely nothing up here? Okay. Yeah, if I got stuck on the other side of that thing, that'd be enough. You, you need some help there, buddy? I'll help you out. I I feel bad. You, you, listen, you're just a businessman trying to get his zombie decks collected, and I'm more than happy to collect. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, think you can juke me? This ain't no 1v1 rust, all right? All right, there's no jukes. All right, my quick scopes don't miss. I let that one miss so the kill cam would look better at the end of the day. Uh, is there anything secret up? No, I think that's just some random, random scrap. The roof of this place is really underwhelming, but there is the secret elevator that we can go to, and that is where I was planning on going. Just want to check, is this? Yep, yeah, I think that is indeed what I thought it was, and I think this is just the same old, same old, where it might be good crates, it might be bad, I'm, uh, oh, uh, Nothing new, man. We get so many repeat books, even like really good repeat books. I don't know what it is, but just flat out, some books are just stupidly hard to find. I will take those shotgun slug books, but some books are just stupidly hard to find. Still, I feel like if we're at the top floor, though, we'll be blessed with some pretty good luck. Yeah, okay, okay. The top floor is pretty good. I think we've gotten only bookstore crates. Mm -hmm. So I think maybe, I think I've noticed a pattern. The higher you get, I feel like just the more likely everything is to be a bookstore box, because so far it's pretty good. And for some reason, the random gun safe. I don't know who... Th I don't know who puts a gun safe on the roof right by a helipad on a book... Why does a bookstore... Sh why does a bookstore tower have a helipad? You know what? All these questions that I've never thought to ask them. Isn't that the exact same? Oh, no. It's not the exact same. Kind of similar. Yeah, there's so many good books we're missing out on. Hopefully we can come through again with a little bit of an empty inventory, get all these books, sell them to my friend Trader Joe, Trader Joel, whichever trader he is, and uh, make a nifty little profit off him. Because I think I think he could use a book or two, you know, maybe learn how to be a more nice person, because he's really mean. He always hurts my feelings, and it sucks. But let's bust through. Actually, you know what we're going to do? We're going to enjoy a little brewski here, all right? We're going to pop open a cold one with the boys. We're gonna enjoy that, so I'll make sure our stamina stays up really high. Yeah, look at that. Stamina isn't even dropping. Or if it is, it's dropping by like one every three hits. Uh, kill some animals. I actually just finally looked at the upper right-hand corner to see what the quest is looking like. It's not looking too awful. It's just that we kind of have to go find a petting zoo and slaughter it. At least that's what it's looking like. Minus the bear. 
I don't think that they have bears in petting zoos unless I'm just going to the wrong petting zoos. If I am, please point me in the direction that has bears in petting zoos. Because that sounds A, like a disaster waiting to happen, and B, absolutely amazing. Especially if it was like a panda, which is kind of like a bear. That'd be awesome. And this is coming my way. Uh, that long barrel's got to go. Dang it. Something else has got to go. These compound bow- No, those are worth- Those are worth a lot! Holy hell, okay, uh, this top has got to go. This top, it has good quality, that's about it. Nothing else is good about it. Everything else here, pretty poopy. We'll scrap it at this point. That pistol receiver is really nice, but also barely worth anything. But okay! Now, time for the secret that I was talking about. We would unearth this is a secret and then head on back. We'll probably sell a couple. We might honestly just go straight to a trader. And uh, try to make some profit. I re let's not fall down there. <laughs> let's not let that happen. That is just a whole ton of pain and suffering waiting to happen. Oh, was not ready for this. Was not ready for this. Ow, ow, please. I did not have my sledgehammer out. Not prepared. Not prepared. Please die, sir. Please just uh, eat, eat, eat fire axe. I, I, I'm sorry. I wanted to give you a quick death. Here, die by foot. I'm, I'm taking out your big toe. All right, you don't need that. You got steel-toed boots keeping you protected. Oh, oh. Yeah, that's what you get. Oh, no, don't die on top of that. I was gonna... Oh. <laughs> I don't know why that was so entertaining, but it was. Yay! Our legs didn't break. Well, that's a first. Ah, of course, we gotta break through this one again. All right, wait. I think I just... Who puts a gun safe in a random elevator? Like, I'm not complaining. Because it means more gun safes for us to open, but... These people... All right, there's something weird going on in this bookstore. At least the pole. Okay, that actually made me jump a little bit. What the hell? That's just a random zombie fart came from the sky. But what is with these people, man? Like, no wonder a zombie apocalypse happened. They're out here like, at least the Higashi Tower guys, right? They don't have things in absurd places. Actually, no, they, they literally hide loot and boxes and like every type of like, I don't know. The people of this world, something's up with them. That's for sure. Okay. I like what I'm seeing here. You know what we might do is we might put on some of these clothes that may or may not cause a heat stroke somewhere down the line. That's okay. Just got to make sure to get home before the heat stroke kicks in. And that's an airdrop that I hear. Uh, mechanical parts to hell with those, I guess. And what is that? Hunting rifle parts? Those aren't too good. Okay, uh, let's mark that thing right now. Oh my god, that's an adventure and a half. We'll be able to go out and get that someday, though. Maybe next episode. For now, not so much. And for now, we have an issue. Yes, yes we do. Hmm. Okay. 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 Eh. Eh. Did not think this one through, did we, laddies? No, we d Oh, yeah, an extra slot there, okay. Uh, wooden frame might be a good investment here. No, there it is. Okay, I was about to type in frame. I just always struggle when it comes to finding the right words for this stuff. All right. Whoop! Whoop! And freedom! Give me back as many of those as I Can I get the last one? Can I uh, I'm not falling? Okay, no, I'm not getting the last one. That's okay. I'll take the L on one wooden frame in exchange for that sawed off that we got that we're gonna be able to flip for a nifty little bit of profit. And profit! Is gonna be extra nifty because we're about to make our first 100k in seven days to die. And a 100k, that is a lot of money. And can I make this jump? Oh, 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 oh. I feel like Rick Ross right now with these noises. Oh, boss. <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, this one we might want to jump. Whoop. Okay, we're not dead. Not dead. This one we can go down rapidly. That's good. And hey, look at that. Rapid descent. Now that we got to the top, going down is the easy part. Although, as I say that, we're probably gonna find a way to break our ankle or something. As is tradition. As is tradition. And what is this? The bottom floor? Yeah, buddy boy. This is the bottom floor. And safety awaits us very shortly. Safety is nice, because it's, you know, not full of pain. Usually, usually safety kind of means, hey, no pain over here. And I'm like, hey, I like you, safety. Let's be best friends. Then you got danger over on the other side of the room to say, yo, get over here. I know you want to get over here. Like, come on, let me break your leg real quick for funsies. Do it for funsies. Uh, so where's the nearest trader? Uh, okay, so the base is kind of on the way. It might- Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, good. It's still marked. I was about to- I- That was about to be bad. <laughs> Not bad, but annoying. 
and make our lives a little bit harder than they should have been. But that's good. Let's leave that there. Next episode, we'll make sure to run over there. Grab- Woo! Accidentally just like- I accidentally just like slapped my mouse. I took it off to scratch my chin for a sec. Goes back and I just smacked the hell out of my mouse. No one- I feel like my mouse is gonna mess with me now. For revenge. I'm gonna be trying to like headshot a zombie. Next thing you know, my mouse is gonna start doing 360s. I'll be looking at it like, Mouse, is you possessed or something? And then my mouse will float. Disconnect itself from my computer and break my window as it flies out to victory on Aladdin's carpet. All right, it's, it's Weird stuff man, but you don't trifle with mices. Mices are Don't don't trifle with them. Don't trifle with them. But oh, what the hell? Why, how the hell is that so broke? What? Hold on, why, how, why would a zombie break that? How would a zombie break that? Zombies usually like hit at their level or below What the hell? That is uh Maybe it's because they were here. Okay, that's what they, they were climbing on top of the bathroom and being hooligans Freaking hooligans in my fire station. How could we but with that we are going to go ahead and gather the rest of our Not the rest of our materials, but we are gonna kind of do some inventory management put in all the importante things that we need and as the and as English is hard and as we do that uh, I'll make sure to oh the mini bike upgrade too. We gotta do that, but I uh, will try to fill our inventory mainly with stuff to sell We will go over there to make some money and as we do that we will begin kind of the process of Go into there's only two nearby traders unless maybe we find one out east. There's a chance not a good one But there's a chance and maybe We even go all the way to that one, but I'm not a hundred percent sure that I don't think that's a trader It might be But it might not I think I it's, I feel like that's a tra I don't know We'll have to, maybe you guys remember and I'm just forgetting. Uh, I'm really good at forgetting things. I apologize I feel like that might be a trader. Looks like it kind of has like a fence around it, right? Maybe? No? Mm, I don't know. We'll see. But other than that, that is gonna wrap up me for now. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Sorry I do need to head out, but there is a test that I still need to take tonight. And after that, I gotta start studying because it's the week before Thanksgiving break. So every class was like, all right, boys, let's have weekly assignments due this week. Let's have, uh, what else can we have done? Oh yeah, a couple of tests on top of that. Let's have a couple quizzes too. And it's just like, I, I, uh, I'm just running off for like six hours. It doesn't, ha doesn't help that I haven't been able to sleep lately. Which kind of sucks. I don't know why. I just can't get comfy in bed. Like, I still fall asleep after like an hour or something, but I just can't get comfy in my bed. It's a struggle. So I can't wait to go home for Thanksgiving break away from college just because like, oh, dude, my bed back at home. That thing is godly. That's going to wrap up me for now. Thank you guys all time for watching. Have yourselves a fan for a fantastic day. And I'll talk to you in the next one. See ya.